This is a single case encounter. Are you ready for your first case? I am. Any questions before we begin? No questions. This is your first encounter. Thank you. Hi. Uh, are the EMT still here? Uh, yes, they are. Okay, I'd like them not to leave. Okay, we'll uh, wait for you, Doc. Thank you very much. And uh, nurse, please. Uh, I would like to get an IV in this patient, ideally two IVs, uh, 18 gauge if possible okay. uh, in the antecubital. Okay. Uh, I would like to place her on the monitor. Okay. Uh, and uh, please place her on oxygen as well, a non rebreather, 100% oxygen would be great. I'll do that for you, doctor. Thank you. Uh, and while you're putting in the IV, please draw some labs, a CBC, a, comp a comprehensive or Chem 7 plus LFTs. Okay. Uh, and let's go ahead and get a serum pregnancy going. Okay. Um, eventually we'll need a, a Foley, but let's get the IV going first. Um, and as soon as that's in and the labs are drawn, we can give her two milligrams of Ativan. Okay. Uh, uh, as well as a glucose check would be very nice. Wonderful. I will uh, do all those for you, doctor. Wonderful. Thank you. And the uh, EMTs, are you still here? Uh, yes, doc. What can we help you with? Thank you for waiting for me. Uh, any history? Uh, you know, we showed up at the grocery store and the store manager had her sitting down on the couch. Uh, he said that she had said that she wasn't feeling well, asked to um, sit down and uh, sat down on the couch and then lay down. And as soon as we got there, she started seizing. So we really didn't get any history at all. Okay. And any family with her or anything like no, that? No, no family. Okay. So we really, we really don't have anything. Don't have a lot of information. No. Okay. Thank you all for waiting around. For no, no problem. Thanks, um, Doc. Do we have the results of that AccuCheck? We do. Finger stick was 100. Okay. And uh, IVs are in. We okay. drew the labs. We're sending them off to the lab right now, Doc. Thank you very much. So a, a quick exam. Is she protecting her airway? She is. Okay. She has a gag reflex. Gag reflex is okay. intact. Any? I, I know they said she was sitting on the couch. Any suggestion of trauma? Any injury around her head? Injury around her neck? Anything no like that? No evidence of of trauma. Okay. When I look at her belly, is there any sense of pregnancy? Uh, obese female. You can't tell. Okay. Um, any edema or anything like that? Uh, she does have some edema uh, in her extremities. One plus. Okay. And do, uh, do I have an ultrasound machine in the department? Unfortunately, it's uh, broken. Okay. And it's out of the department for maintenance. Okay. Um, any response to the two milligrams of Ativan? Uh, no response. Patient is still seizing. Okay. Do I have uh, any chance that I have that pregnancy result back? Uh, it's at the lab. They're working on it as fast as we can. Okay. Uh, so we have a 25-year-old female who is seizing. Um, her glucose is normal. She's not responded to the Ativan. I'd like to give her another two milligrams of Ativan. Uh, and then if she does not respond to that, we're going to give her some magnesium. Okay. And presume that she is pregnant. Uh, I've drawn up the Ativan, and here are the results okay. coming back. So thank you. So we do That's have a, the first result you have back? We have a positive pregnancy, so I'd like to give her four grams of IV magnesium uh, bolus, and then we can start a drip at two grams per hour. That's a magnesium um, bolus, four grams IV, followed by two uh, grams of a drip, and there are some additional labs for you, Doc. Great, thank you. And I'm noting her platelets are, are low on here. I don't see the LFTs back yet, so we'll still be waiting for those. Um, any response to the magnesium? The patient's uh, seizing has stopped. Okay, and I'll, I'll want some repeat vitals, please. And, and Absolutely, I'll work on those. I have the repeat vitals for you. Great, thank you. I have a blood pressure of 180 over 110, pulse of 100, respirations of 22, temperature of 99, and her pulse ox is 100% on her non rebreather. Okay. Hi, ma'am. Uh, Ms. Simmons, this is Dr. Schenkel. How are you? Mm. Can you Can you hear me at all, ma'am? You, my head. Okay, I want to let you know what's going on. You're you're at Avon General Hospital. Uh, you just had a seizure. Uh, it looks like you're pregnant, and we're treating you for a condition called eclampsia. Have you had high blood pressure at all, or anything like that? Mm -hmm. Are you are you allergic to any medicines? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we we really don't have much in terms of responsiveness. Uh, let's go ahead and get a CT scan of her head. Okay. And for I'll the blood that pressure, you. thank you. I'd like to give her some labetalol, 20, 20 milligrams IV of labetalol. Okay. Uh, and we're going to do a bit more of a physical exam. I'm again, now that I have a, a brief moment to check, look for any suggestion of trauma, any bruising, injury. 
Uh, no additional evidence of trauma, no bruising is appreciated. Pe I do have the uh, additional LFTs. Great, thank you. Pupils are equal and responsive. Pupils are equal. And she's continuing responsive. to protect her airway. Protecting her airway. Lungs clear. Normal exam. Okay, cardiac exam. Tachycardic, otherwise normal exam. Okay. And again, repeat abdominal exam, looking for any masses, other suggestion of. What specifically are you looking for? Uh, any suggestion of pregnancy. Uh, again, uh, she's obese female, cannot tell if the uterus okay. is gravid. Okay. Uh, and you had mentioned before, I think, uh, her lower extremities. She okay, does have edema. She does have edema in her okay. lower extremities, okay. one plus edema. Any response to that labetalol? all? She has improvement in her uh, systolic blood pressure. Her blood pressure is now uh, 160 over 90. Okay, wonderful. Thank you. Uh, and I'm going to check her reflexes now that we have the magnesium aboard. Wonderful. And she has two plus reflexes bilaterally. Okay. Two plus reflexes. Uh, thank you. I, I'd like to get her admitted to OB. Can we call our obstetrician, please? Unfortunately, there is no uh, OBGYN at this hospital. Okay. Ma'am, Ms. Simmons, this is Dr. Schenkel again. Do you know the name of your OB, please? Okay. Uh, I would like to call the OB that I have available to transfer her. Okay. I'll work on getting the transferring physician uh, on the Thank line. Uh, and if as we have I a ultrasound availability, I, I'd like an ultrasound uh, of her. Okay. Abdomen, Unfortunately, so. the ultrasound machine is, is still broken, but I do okay. have the results of the head CT. Wonderful. Okay. Thank okay. you. And uh, I have that doctor on that you requested on the line. Okay. Hello, doctor. This is Steve Shankle calling from ABEM General. I have a 25-year-old pregnant female who had a seizure. Looks like she has eclampsia and is... Uh, their low platelets is uh, in the midst of HELP syndrome. I'd like to send her your way, please. At this point, we have a magnesium drip going. I've got an unremarkable head CT completed. Uh, she's had some labetalol for her blood pressure uh, and got a couple of milligrams of Ativan while we were figuring everything out. Okay. Uh, it sounds uh, appropriate. We'd love to uh, take care of her and accept her. We'll send a medic Great. right away. Thank you so much. I appreciate your help. Thanks, Doc. Okay. This ends the case scenario. Great. Thank you.